Built on the Ethereum blockchain and with the Swap protocol, AirSwap gives you privacy, security, and choice on a global peer-to-peer -peer trading network. Hey everybody, in this video of Proof of Make, we take a look at AirSwap and Fluidity. Fluidity is the maker of AirSwap. AirSwap is a platform that is used to swap tokens like Maker, GNT, Dai, Omizgo, oh Ken, Wrapped F. In this video, we take a look at how it works from a practical perspective as a user, and we all sit down with our CTO Ty and take a look. Here we go. All right, so now I'm gonna sit down with our CTO Ty and talk about AirSwap. All right, so let's take a look at AirSwap. So very simply, with AirSwap, you can pick a random token. So I'm going to click DEB. You can connect with MetaMask. And then you sign the transaction. And you say how much of it you want to buy. So I'm going to buy one DEB. I'll click Find Sellers. And it'll tell me the price. So that's pretty cheap. I'm going to buy some of this just as an example. And then you click Confirm. And it's that simple. What I like a lot about AirSwap that a lot of dApps on the Ethereum blockchain don't do is give you an estimated wait time uh, and kind of a count up. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So that's pretty. So that's pretty handy. So in a few seconds, this will confirm. I can see the transaction on EtherScan, and every transaction goes through this smart contract called the AirSwap protocol contract, and you can see kind of what the traffic looked like. So this was me just now, and you can see that you know every you know, hour or so there's one, two or three transactions right now. So there's not that much traffic on the yeah. AirSwap um, protocol yet, but uh, that's a look at how that works. So it's been successful. Now, one thing that I noticed that it doesn't have is you can't really look at your portfolio. I just bought that. Right. There's really, it's really hard to see it. By default, MetaMask makes you load tokens in. Like you have to go to here. I have to click add tokens, right? Um, so that, what I just bought just doesn't show up by default. Right. Um, so, so I, now I need to go in and yeah, actually add that token and, 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 and things like that. So it, it would be nice. One website that does do that and which I like their UI a lot, I think that AirSwap could, inter, that could kind of integrate into their design is um, Toddle. So what they do is they kind of show your portfolio like this. Oh, that's handy. Yeah, and I, I, I could see you know, this being inside of AirSwap. It would be really nice. So that's a simple look at how it works. You could also sell. So I could take... You know, if I have, um, and they really, they center around, so when AirSwap did their token sale, they really focused on search being one of the key pieces. You can basically search for any token and find it. So I can type in Augur, find uh, the REP token by Augur, and then I approve it for trading, and then I can immediately put it, um, I can basically sell it right now. And that's, that's kind of it. So you're not making any markets on right. this side of things. So on the major, so I'm on instant.airswap.io. This is what most people click on. Uh, you go there and you, you you do that. So I I approve it for trading and then I can make my trade. So I approved it for trading and then I can actually say I want to sell one REP. Find buyers. It'll look for market makers. Um, and I can just go boom, buy it. It'll tell me the expiration of how long that swap that deal lasts, that that particular price, and boom. There, there we go. So uh, right. after a little bit of time, so occasionally, yeah, it will go over the expected time. Right. Uh, you, it's really hard to get that as a perfect science, just because the Ethereum blockchain, you know, you can't really, really know. But uh, if they really improve that to be kind of closer, kind of like Uber does. Uber doesn't know how long it's going to take a driver to get somewhere, but they kind of readjust the estimation Based and they don't let it go over. So it'd be fifty-six seconds. Oh, maybe this will go up. So that was just confirmed. I see it on MetaMask, right. um, and I guess it's just taking them a little bit of time. Okay, so about four seconds within it happening. And then the other thing is that when you oh, do it, so, yeah. So when okay. you, oh yeah, it all yeah. So it always sells. It, it, if you if you have the deal, if it tells you, it's going to execute. So that, that's the thing about AirSwap. It's going to swap out. It, you're going to get your trade. Right, you don't right. have to worry about that. So it's like doing a market trade. Names and wrapped F. To, yeah. So take care of. so wrapped F. If you're not familiar, is just F that's wrapped as an ERC twenty token. So what you'll need to do is unwrap it. You just click, you know, max, and all of my F, WETH will be turned convert to F. Cool. So a lot of decentralized exchanges are using WETH instead of F, um, and that just makes it more convenient for trading. Um, so there, so that, that's essentially how AirSwap works on a, on the front side, and this will happen. I don't have to keep that up. Now you can look at your account history, and as you can see here, um, it's not the you know I'd like to see maybe a full window here. 
And even when you yeah. click on it, it just goes to the ether scan. So I like to see my you know, portfolio as well as you know maybe a full page for. Is this, this uh, beta of... software? Or... So it doesn't say beta. It doesn't say beta. So it's not. It's not. They're not beta. It, okay, they're saying right. this is this is a product. This, this is their product. full product. This is this now, is the exchange. Right? Yeah, they don't have a lot of transactions or transaction volume. Well, how how does this actually work? And so if you go to their space, if you click on Spaces, AirSwap Spaces, um, let's let's head over to AirSwap Spaces. Yeah, I want to make some markets, Mike. Yeah, let's make markets. It's my childhood dream. Yeah. So you go here inside of Spaces, um, and here's where you can be a market maker. Okay. So here um, now you'll need. So let me switch accounts so you can see what what'll happen. Let's go over to another account. Let's say I want to make markets in the blue protocol. I'll click connect and I'll click new trade. And I want to buy maybe one uh, blue for, a day. you know, I, I'll set this up. And what it'll say is, uh, I can skip this. I don't have to actually connect. It's going to say that I need 250 AST, which is the air swap token. And we'll do that. So that's the value of their token. It's you, you use it to stake. 200, 250, that's about worth about $20. Right. So I have to buy their token first in order to make markets. So every market maker needs to have their token, stake them, and then perform the trade. So you buy that, so I can switch back to an account that actually has them. All right, so now I can, um, so I can look here and see like, for example, ad chain. This is me, you can see your post. I am buying one ADT. That's the, the ad chain token. So that's kind of how that works. So I'm making markets. Uh, they have a chat over here where you can talk to people. Yeah, it looks a little inactive. Yeah, it's not, it's not, it's not very active, but um, it's there. And it's good that, to yeah, see that yeah. they, they have this kind of stuff. Um, and uh, yeah, they have messaging in their platform. So And so that, that leads us to Fluidity. So what happened was they kind of pulled a Google. Okay. Um, they said, okay, we have this one tool and we're going to create a parent company called Alphabet, and it's gonna have a lot of other things because we wanna do AI, we wanna do all these other things. Right, right. So the founding team, the same team from AirSwap is now doing Fluidity. Okay. And so you can check out this. So, so one interesting piece of news that recently came out was that Fluidity is tokenizing real world assets. For example, they signed an agreement to tokenize debt for a commercial building in Manhattan. So oh, they're bringing okay. blockchain to the real estate markets. So here's a quick snip from a Bloomberg feature that was recently published. Welcome to New York City, the crown jewel of the real estate market. Everybody wants a piece. And now, thanks to blockchain technology, that may very well be possible. So by tokenizing the debt, it gives everyone breathing room to sell at a normal pace with the market instead of against it. So Airswap's a part of this. And they're really wanting to focus now on tokenization. Okay. So they partnered with a company called Propeller, and Propeller is actually going through all the, like a lot of the legal stuff with along along with with Fluidity in order to actually take care of the legal stuff and, and actually get tokens onto the Ethereum blockchain right. that are backed by real world assets and enforced by law. So they're kind of using that because right now, like we saw, they don't have that much transaction volume. But I think what their play is, what they're thinking is, what we can do is have a if we have real world assets, and since we have such an easy to use interface with our instant product, what we'll probably soon start to see here um, is potentially real world backed assets. Now, that's not for sure mm -hmm. because for example, with the new asset they're putting out, you have to be a, a high net worth individual okay. in the United States and you have to declare that, et cetera. Have they announced any plans yet to uh, when they're going to be bringing in those tokens, what the protocol those tokens will be on. So yeah. I imagine it's going to be similar to like ERC-20, but um, th there haven't been any major like confirmed announcements. Okay. We just know from the, we just know that what the media is saying and what they're saying to the media about it, that they're working towards this. And those, those will be treated, the, assumably they'll be treated the same as the tokens we have already on the AirSwap. Console. So we don't know that because th with security tokens, there's a lot more regulation right, things right, like that. Right, so right. I think that's why they be have become fluidity. So they can open up new product lines. New product lines, lines maybe for you, high network okay. individuals to trade tokens, et cetera. So we'll, it's yet to see, we'll, we'll see what's happening, but I think that that's the play there. And so uh, that's kind of what the connection between fluidity and AirSwap is. Yeah, I'm looking at the AirSwap and it feels a lot kind of like Coinbase in a way. It's almost active, that, that atomic swap system, it's very feels very brokerage-like. 
It's it's very simple. You're not looking at a bunch of indicators and not having to deal with candlesticks. So especially if you're just trying to get in there and you already know the moving price or the average price, or the aggregate price, you can go in there and move things around as you need to. Just get the things you need, get to that trade as quickly as possible, build that portfolio. Yeah, and I think yeah, I think it's mostly for the retail guys and the yeah. market maker side is more so for the institution. Yeah, but I think um, because there's so much competition out there, they're going to need something like real world assets. Um, to, to kind of yeah, I, it's going to be interesting. I think for any of the platforms that are like this to see what what do they get in there, what are their kind of um, trademark or their prestige assets that they get in there to introduce the concept. Because right now I think everyone has the idea of what a token is for a project, but we're now talking about something that's a little more broad that requires more assurance, that requires a little more information, and I guess knowing the institution. So I'm really interested in seeing what other kind of buffeting products they create to support that new market. Yeah, it's going to be really interesting to watch. So yeah. that is Fluidity and AirSwap.